DC motors are an interesting electrical device to work with. While they are particularly designed to convert electrical energy into mechanical energy, they can also do the reverse. That's what the hand crank generator video is based upon. The video shows how to take advantage of gear system using a DVD player to increase the resulting cranking speed and thus to generate useful amount of power. But why to use our effort when there is energy given to us freely by Mother Nature, the wind energy? Therefore, in this video, let's build a wind turbine with easily available resources and find out whether it's worth it to build one. Let's get started. Now using multimeter is quite unreliable to keep track of the power generated, so a microcontroller is deployed to take sample data every 100 milliseconds. The average power generated during the experiment is about 119 milliwatt with a peak power of about 1 watt. This is not that bad with such a puny little generator and roughly the nature of the wind turbine. Power extraction however can be increased with the use of larger generator and efficient design of the wind turbine. The windy locations should be chosen for the turbine and the energy produced can be stored in batteries so that batteries keep charging when there is wind and we can use the stored energy anytime we require. So overall building such a wind turbine is worth it. Hope you enjoyed the video. If so, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and hit that notification bell icon. Thanks for watching.